I have a series on my YouTube channel about curb appeal helps you seal the deal when you're looking to buy or looking to sell a home and one of the features I've talked about is uh, water features Stephen here has a water feature that is I mean you can go from a, a, a simple almost zero maintenance water feature to kind of a high maintenance water feature maybe a little more elaborate you know but yeah. it's not bad so anyway I want to have Steve just explain this a little bit and then I'm gonna walk around and show you this water feature in his backyard he's the original builder had this home built did all the landscaping and for more information you know message me I'd love to help you out we can get you an architect or contractor refer you somebody if you're interested in doing a water feature it'll add it can add a ton of value to your home if you can't maintain it it, it will hurt your home so so be wise but anyway okay you built this home and had it built uh, the contractor you had a separate landscape architect designed all this right yes we had this water feature done by brought landscaping oh yeah and Perry brought is a good friend uh, they did a terrific job in fact we were on vacation in Mexico all he had was the plans we came back and the water feature was done so I, I think he did that on purpose so we wouldn't get in his way while we were working on it you know Okay, now but, you've got a couple additional features here. You've got fish. Right. We it, do. You've got so so it's not just a waterfall and stream, but there are fish. Um, but I mean, the fish are surviving each year. They they make it through the winter. The fish, I don't know if they'll poke their heads up here. If you can get them on uh, camera here, Brian. But uh, we have nine. Uh, we have seven fish in the pond now, and we have two Japanese koi, uh, a common goldfish just poking her head out there. Her name is Motor. Uh, she. That's a long story, but she was a little tiny one inch goldfish. Now she's a nine inch beautiful fish. We have two butterfly koi, and we have two shubunkan koi, which is kind of a crossbreed between a uh, goldfish and a Japanese koi. Uh, with, with this many lily pads in the pond, uh, they like it in the shade, so they're not out a lot, but uh, uh, the fish winter in the pond, uh, we take all of the vegetation out in the winter time, and the pond ices over and the fish stay down at the bottom. We have a little heater over by the pump which keeps the water above freezing level and the fish more or less hibernate at the bottom of the pond and they all survive the winter. That's awesome. Yeah, that, it's a lot of fun. That is so cool. Yeah. Anyway, okay, I'm gonna walk up here a little bit so that we can get a view also. I mean, you can see what he's done here as far as digging out. He has a walkout basement, uh, has the waterfall pond uh, up at the top is, is just the, um, where the, the water recycles, so there's upper a, pond in the top. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, Stephen, I appreciate you letting me show this uh, on Welcome. my on my Facebook. So, I'm gonna walk up this way. You can see also he's got some landscaping here with the the terraced uh, stones. He's got some tables, the uh, umbrellas. I'm gonna walk up here a little bit, and you can see he's got he's got lawn over here, and on this side. A putting green so anyway pretty cool if you're like I say if you're interested in doing an art a water feature I mean really look into it and again we can uh, get you some references of contractors and, and architects and and water features can just add I mean for the cost of the water features from what I've seen and, and again depending on where your house is and what you do with it the size of it and everything uh, it, it can definitely increase the value of your home substantially really you want people again with our, our curb appeal help seal the deal series we're looking to get people into your home get them up you know pull up to the, the curb love the front yard love the home doing something like this in the backyard which is where most water features are just as kind of the icing on the cake if you maintain it okay three reasons to have a, a water feature is uh, number one highest and best use of your property if you maintain it if you don't maintain it you're better to go with the grass and the shrubs and the flowers second is health wise this is my opinion the sound of water is just i mean mentally psychologically i don't know if you think of that no this this is my uh refuge out here yeah i just come out here and relax put my feet up and have a cool drink and enjoy the area uh, hit some putts on the putting green and uh, this is kind of this is my place just to kind of get away and relax so I mean whether you can hear it from your master bedroom or you come out on the deck water is just soothing so second third reason it helps eliminate other noises okay um, I mean you've this was uh, what'd you say Gillespie orchards right it was an apple orchard and it's developed you've got houses all around you so right. I'm sure this helps eliminate you know whether you've got neighbors maybe a dog whatever you've got traffic 
Uh, if you're up like where I live, maybe it eliminates the bugling of the elk or something like that. But uh, <laughs> That's going to be rough. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so, so top three reasons why you do it and, and really look into it. If it's something that you're interested in, jump into it and, and do your water feature. Right? And if you'd like a putting green too, we can send you over to Backyard Greens. Uh, Cecil at Backyard Greens does a great job. This is a putting green that putts uh, as, as nicely as any country club. It's really a true putting green, uh, except it's an artificial turf. So it's really a lot of fun. People come over and have a great time. Excellent. Hey, one more plug I forgot to mention. Stephen is with Guaranteed Rate. Uh, and so, I mean, this is usually real estate. I'm talking about real estate. But if you're looking for lending, uh, you know, as far as financing, Guaranteed Rate, uh, a great mortgage company, uh, you know, great competition. If you're looking at a credit union or a bank, also give him a shot. Uh, they just, they have some great things going on. You always have great things going on. We do, we do. We love beating those guys up. They hate us. The banks don't like us, but we're, uh, we can help your clients. Excellent, excellent. All right, you guys, take care, and uh, let me know if you have any questions. Love to help you out.